your ass. <laughs> she don't get your ass. It's my first time in Shimokitazawa. Yeah, me too. Don't fuck with me. Yeah. God damn. Yeah, I got my chest rig. <laughs> got my everything. What is that? This is an Osmo action, sir. I don't fuck with GoPro. All right. <laughs> oh, fuck the GoPro here. I don't fuck with GoPro. <laughs> Mainstream. What's the What's the difference with this one? This one's better. Uh, that's that's, that's the only that's difference. The only... <laughs> <laughs> now just have a front screen, so you can see yourself. Oh. You basically don't have to use a extra phone and stuff to see yourself. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. It's like fifty bucks cheaper too. So. So how much is it total? Uh, I paid three forty. So it's not bad. At That's that bad time, around. GoPro was like four something. So. Okay. So right now we're just walking through Shimo Kitazawa. And Shimo Kitazawa is known for their... Thrift shopping? Their shopping. And also known for their... Baddest bitches of all time. Baddest bitches of all time. There we go. That's why we're really here. What, 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 what? That's why we're really here. So. Just walking through. Chilling Friday afternoon. Amid the coronavirus, global pandemic. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> yeah, we had a couple of friends recommend us this area for vintage shopping. So we're gonna check it out. Shimo Kitazawa is one stop on the express, express train from Shibuya. So it's like over, just a little over 100 yen. 126 yen. 100, 126 yen, there you go. Really cheap yen. in Japan. So, it's actually really close to Shibuya, super easy to get to. Yeah, it's like three minutes ride too. So, bitch from my place, that was like almost an hour. But, <laughs> <laughs> that aside. Nice little section of CDG Junior. Right? Yeah. This is Junimon when it came out? It used to be. How much is it right now? Um, oh, oh. Nimon, no? Okay, dang. Yeah, I guess no one wants it. 200 bucks? These are fire, though. What the this is a clean cab, actually. Ooh. I've been down so long ago. I've never seen a Supreme cab, actually. That's a Supreme? Yeah, it's clean. What the heck? No dope, no hope. <laughs> no dope, no hope, <laughs> that's, man. That's the truest thing I've ever heard. It's true, though. <laughs> little 3M heavyweight supreme this is a Swarovski black very clean yeah ragtag has really good prices for like just random pieces you know yeah Of vintage tees here, let's do hard rock. Nice little Disney. This is pretty clean. Vintage Bart. Not bad, not bad. So this place has a sale 30 50% off the additional off like the price tag. So these are all really cheap. Most of the stuff in here is like what? Between 20 30 bucks? About 20 30 bucks. That's not bad at all. Cool selection though. It's kind of like in a secluded little area. It's kind of weird because most of the Japanese thrift stores like expensive. I know. Yeah, this place is like really cheap. Not bad at all. Not bad, not bad. It's crazy because it's like. Inside out material. Yeah. That's crazy. What the heck? Oh, 
In and out tees. Yeah, I'm looking for like this color. Ooh, okay, okay. I'm gonna try this. Soft color. 45? Yeah, soft color, little springtime vibes, you know? Oh shit. What the fuck? That's fire. The mids, yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. Flexing on This is like the best like blanks of all time. Camber, yeah. Oh wow. They're so is... heavyweight. But they're pretty expensive in Japan. But like if you get them in the States, they're like really really nice. How much is it? Like in the States? In the States are like maybe like 40, oh, really? like 30. Camber. Camber, yeah. Camber. So nice. But like how much are these here? It is like Kosenko here, guys. Really nice though. Like crazy. Being women. It's the same pattern as the Supreme. They came out with jeans, Levi's. A long time ago, a few years ago. Been for that for a while, actually. It's nice, actually. You fuck with it? Yeah, yeah. 100 bucks. <laughs> yeah, I dig this store. Vintage and used. 10 out of 10. Not 11? Not 11. <laughs> It's just a bunch of these around, huh? Mm. Just like store after old, store. Like old American apparel stores. I don't know. So many of them. So many good ones? Yeah. Pretty crazy. So we've walked by at least, I'd say like seven shops. At least seven shops, maybe. At least seven here. Yeah. They're like they're like on every corner, huh? Every single. It's corner. crazy. They're mostly mostly American vintage, like goods, you know. Like Carhartt, Dickies. Yeah, a bunch of Carhartt, Dickies, yeah. a bunch of Levi's. Hard Rock Cafe. Yeah, a lot of Hard Rock Cafe Dickies. A lot of. For them. some <laughs> reason, I feel he's like maybe maybe a hundred Hard Rock Cafe Dickies. I don't know. If, I don't even know if you can get that many in so many like shops, you know? Yeah, a little too much. A little too much. A little too much. Not bad though. I smell some vintage clothing. The other funny thing is that we came across like maybe 20 curry shops. <laughs> like so many curry shops. SD Kareno-ji-sama. Especially in like soup curry shop. There was one, I don't know what the name of that one was, where there was like, there's yeah, like, like, there's like 50 girls, 50 girls, Karate. only girls, I don't know why, 50 girls like standing in line for curry, and the guy was like, yeah, I don't know, it must have been on TV or some shit. <laughs> they said it was on Twitter. Oh, it was on Twitter, really? <laughs> I mean, not gonna lie, it looked good. It looked good. But it was it good. worth, was it worth a two hour wait? Nope. Eh. And the price though? Woo. Yeah, how much was it? Woo. Like 12 bucks. Fucking curry. Yeah, I ain't about that life. Curry's like... 7, 800 yen, you know? But some places out here, they're like 2,000, 2,500. Oh my like, god. Really now? Is that, is that, a, is that Starbucks? Oh shit, oh shit. Uh, eagle, eagle eye? Eagle eye? <laughs> <laughs>
Put that in. Make sure it catches. Make sure that's in. Get that to the start line. Good to go. Good to go. We got Mr. Stalker over here. People. Check out the ladies. You already know. With the 85 mil. 50 mil, sir. 50 mil. <laughs> Shibuya. <laughs> oh, Shibuya. <laughs> Might be fun. Like a first two trips. Yeah, after That's that. Not, after that, nah. It's just loud. Bro. Avoid at all costs. Bro. Avoid at all costs. <laughs> yeah, the vintage selection in Shimokido is pretty good. It. I don't know how to explain it. It's like, it's kind of sus though, because... All American. It's all like American vintage and like... All American vintage. I have, everything. I have one of the friends who actually works for the shop in Hiroshima. I forgot the name. It's like Kingpin vintage or something like that. Kingpin? I don't know if it's Kingpin. But, so essentially what they do is they just go to like Rose Bowl in California, LA, or like Goodwill or places like that. And they grab just like everything, everything they can find. Everything it's always that's... like, it's always like Carhartt, Dickies, Hard Rock. Hard Rock Cafe Tees, um, Band Tees, just vintage stuff like that. I think the best shop was Ragtag actually. Cause it's Ragtag- always, always the best, always the best. Ragtag's got like, it's got vintage tees and stuff, but it also has more- High end stuff. High end stuff, yeah. but it's still cheap. So like they have Supreme obviously. Um, one of the brands that they had a lot of was FCRB. So good. FCRB's so nice. It's so nice, so cheap in Japan too. I know, I don't know why it's so cheap. So FCRB is FC Rail Bristol, and they used to do exclusive like a partnership with Nike. Yeah. But recently they tailed off from Nike and they do it with Softnet. Um, Which is Japanese company, right? Softnet. Yeah, Softnet is Japanese company. Wait, let me get this shot. Man's always at work. Man with the Sony A7. A7 III, boy. <laughs> Best mirrorless camera. Of all time. Yeah, I've been rocking the Canon 6D, 35 Sigma 1.4 for like, whew. That's like 50 pounds. <laughs> Bro, it's, it's, it's a workout every it's time we use it. Yeah. yeah, Ryan and I have been using that. I be, I got it after Ryan, because Ryan told me it's a really good one. Uh, but that thing's like, cool. it's like 10 pounds. Wait, wait, wait. We have to plug Cooney Dude, though. Oh, true, Cooney Dude, Cooney yeah. Dude. Ryan Archibald. Shout so out good. at Cooney Dude on Instagram. So good, film. So freaking good. He doesn't Cooney use fam. Ad, he doesn't use autofocus. Yeah, yeah, for film. Never use autofocus. Only manual focus. And he nails it every single time. God shot. doesn't he doesn't believe in autofocus. Right. FCRB is really nice because their older pieces are all like not vintage, vintage, but older Nike pieces that you haven't really seen much of. Yeah, I don't. So I don't, unique. They don't really sell in the states, do they? Only it's kind of just mostly just Japanese clothing shops have it very exclusive on medicati it's super cheap so cheap and their pieces are really nice like the older nike pieces like a good leather jacket it runs for like 160 bucks i know yeah. even like 120 we found probably like 20 it was 10. 120 and it was like the top and bottom yeah nah i don't get why fcrb doesn't blow up in the states football club rail bristol Real but it's bristol. not even i don't even think it's based out of the uk bristol city in, in no, england it's based in japan so i don't even know i gotta look into like how they found their their name but definitely nice pieces. Very dope pieces. Highly recommend. Yeah, that was probably one of the best the best items they had out there. If you guys want to get like American vintage apparel, just get in the States, it's way cheaper. If you're gonna get like high-end Japanese uh, thrift, just go to Ragtag. Yeah, true. So buy it. Very true. No, Harry Preston was cheap too. I know, Harry Preston was right? super cheap, yeah. Like all the pieces are cheap. That was so weird. Margiela, APC, APC pants? APC? APC pants were like APC. Five, 50 bucks. I don't know, it's stupid. Cop? Yeah, it's stupid. So I've been trying to kill this roll. It's like um, it's a Fuji. I've hit like 14 shots. We only get 16 shots per roll. So like each shot is like 50 yen. Nah, it's stupid. It's like, it's that's stupid. like half a dollar, bro. Cause like it's 20 bucks to develop the film. I mean the film itself is like 10 bucks. So 30 bucks for 16 shots, it's like 50 yen. 
Nah, I don't know. That's like tears in my Too eyes. Too much. <laughs> shots are crazy. Shots are clean, though. Yeah, shots are clean. Shots are clean. Super detailed. Yeah. So I've got like two, two or three more shots. 